All right, so in this problem, I have 81 to the power of x is equal to x to the power of 18. So I want to find the value of x here. So for my solution, I'm going to rewrite this equation. So 81 to the power of x is equal to x to the power of 18. And now, I'm going to take the power of 1 over x on both sides. So I get 81 to the power of x to the power of 1 over x is equal to x to the power of 18 to the power of 1 over x. And now if I have something in the form a to the power of m to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m times n. So 81 to the power of x times 1 over x is equal to 81 to the power of 1, which is the same thing as 81. So I get 81 is equal to x to the power of 18 to the power of 1 over x. And x to the power of 18 to the power of 1 over x is the same thing as x to the power of 18 times 1 over x, which is the same thing as x to the power of 18 over x. Now, I'm going to take the power of 1 over 18 on both sides. So I get 81 to the power of 1 over 18 is equal to x to the power of 18 over x to the power of 1 over 18. And this is the same thing as 81 to the power of 1 over 18 is equal to x to the power of 18 over x times 8 times 1 over 18, and these two 18s cancel out, so I get 81 to the power of 1 over 18 is equal to x to the power of 1 over x. Now, 81 here is the same thing as 9 squared. So I'm going to rewrite this as 9 squared to the power of 1 over 18 is equal to x to the power of 1 over x. And now this is the same thing as 9 to the power of 2 times 1 over 18 is equal to x to the power of 1 over x. And 2 times 1 over 18 is the same thing as 1 over 9. So I get 9 to the power of 1 over 9 is equal to x to the power of 1 over x. Now, notice how this is in the form a number to the power of 1 over that same number is equal to x to the power of 1 over x, meaning x is equal to this number 9. So now, going back to the original equation, let's go ahead and check if this is right. So I have 81 to the power of x is equal to x to the power of 18. So x is equal to 9. So if I plug in 9 for x, I get 81 to the power of 9 is equal to 9 to the power of 18. Now, 81 is the same thing as 3 to the power of 4, and 9 is the same thing as 3 squared. So I get 3, 3 to the power of 4 to the power of 9 is equal to 3 squared to the power of 18. And if I have something in the form a to the power of m to the power of n, that's equal to a to the power of m times n. So 3 to the power of 4 to the power of 9 is equal to 3 to the power of 4 times 9, which is 3 to the power of 36. And this is equal to 3 to the power of 2 to the power of 18, which is equal to 3 to the power of 36 as well. So this is right.